So hi everyone, I'm coming at you to show you these nails that I did and they're really simple nails and I want to show you what I used to make this mix. It's really simple. I found this at Five Below. It's called Glam Chick and it is a shimmer powder and inside of it is this little bottle of this shimmer powder here. I believe I paid like not more than three dollars for this bottle and it's just a very fine glitter and it's white and sparkly and beautiful and it made a great set and all I did was mix it with clear acrylic that's all this with clear acrylic to get these beautiful nails beautiful mix 60% of this and 40% of the clear acrylic, give or take a little bit more. So, all right. So if you'd like to see how I did these, please stay tuned. The last thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to apply a layer of a hard gel on top of my acrylic nails. Hard gel just means that it is either hard gel, builder gel, it's not a soak off, which means it's a drill off. So the reason I apply the hard gel over the acrylic nails is that if I want to paint my nails a lot, which I do like to, or if your clients like to paint their nails in between fills, this will protect the acrylic you won't have staining from the nail polish and when you use 100% acetone on acrylic nails that are not protected um, they have a tendency to get kind of gummy soft sometimes sticky uh, the, that it weakens the acrylic so this just helps to protect the acrylic and you can paint it as many times as you like and remove it remove it with uh, the paint with acetone and, it, and the acrylic won't be affected also, any time that I use colored acrylics, I always just cap them in a hard gel. I never cap my colored acrylics in 
clear acrylic anymore. This just seems to do the trick. It makes the nail stay um, nice and thin and it also gives it a very high shine.